what do you think of Superman's skills or power in God? For me, this person's faith might have pop up. John Law, who proposed a conception of justice as fairness. At the time, the most widely accepted theory of morality was new utilitarianism, primarily concerned with the idea of democracy. The principle of utilitarianism must be understood here. That the greater happiness of the majority is achieved by neglecting the right and interest of minority. But as for all, he says, this view was extremely unfair in his eye for the main reason being that government had to be independent and rational. No one should be left for the sake of others. Therefore, giving one person as sacrifice for survival of the whole world is not a concept that equates justice with planet. Plus, social contact theory is a set of justice concept for allocating basic life and obligation and dividing social benefit in the community. How can we make a fair adjustment to create a justice? These elements consist of two things in order for us to achieve the justice as fairness. First, the view of ignorance and the original position. Raw suggests that we return to the original position. In process where we move ourselves to the original position, it creates a reflection of the principle of the state that exists in society. This was developed with the view of ignorance. If you look at this picture, everyone can see the curtain in the middle. This view is an element key to distinguish the situation in which in its natural state. In the absence of view, there is an influential person capable with the money, the power to put the pressure on the person to be precise. The variable who are weakened by any factor in society because the other is in a better position. Let's move behind the view that divide the, this middle. Uh, let's try to think and think behind the curtain of the view of ignorance to be the original position that is completely unconditional. Think about how by we are and know nothing about the people we are interact with within society, whether it's a place, gender or income level. Um, that puts by at us. Uh, that behind the view of ignorance, we will be in the same original position as the fair adjustment. It would be too easy to learn a philosophy related lesson without any principle to memorize. Um, law developed two principles of justice that um, the self interest and rational person chooses once behind the view of ignorance. In these two main principles, the second principle presents two subconscious, giving us three principles to remember in total. Um, the first gets that equal liberty principle or principle of equal liberty. After we are in the original position, we will be at the point where everyone has equal rights to fundamental freedom, which includes freedom of conscience, freedom of expression, association, and democratic life. With the right to, <clears throat> to personal property, it's one of the fundamental freedom that a person has. The government itself cannot infringe or modify this right. However, John Watson, that beautiful, he understood that um, there were socioeconomic inequality that had to be allocated differently with the regard to the other two causes. For the cause, the different principle, look at this. Um, to the greater benefit of the least advantage. This means that we have to understand the economic model and policy in the society, have to build for the benefit of the lead beneficiaries in society. As good as it is, the lead distribution of light cannot be distributed to and benefit the disadvantage in society. To understand more, now everyone can imagine that if we create a policy for the rich, then the poor use the same policy that um, work it for it. Do you think um, they will benefit? So of course the answer is clear that in this system, the poor will continue to be poor, not given any chance. Another concept is cause B. 
uh, the equal opportunity principle providing different amount of resource such as subsidy is not what brought his suggestion, but what he recommend is to open the positions to everyone under conditions of fair opportunity, some of whom might need more distribution of position and more opportunity are required. Actually, let's look at the application of his theory to the law of business. It may be true that many scholars have come forward to say that our theory is only related to politics and society, but if we look in deeper, his principle can be applied to business as well. First, law principle lead to decision-making in form of the base interlaced with a key business strategy. In this business process, we will be able to use the concept of ignorance to get the maximum benefit for the company. For example, in the process of recruiting or promoting employees, the law of a good employee must not take into account in gender, social status, or race. In the same is to in the external area where interactions are coordinated by the use of relationships by individuals. In the case of doing business with outsiders, it can usually lead to wrong decision. The second one, the main part of differentiation can be used in issuing policy for companies in order to optimize the benefit that will be provided to the members who benefit the most, such as where women are often exploited um, there may be a policy that protects against sexual harassment, which is reality for everyone in the company. This is common when everyone is aware that men are often seen as an advantage, so this policy was created to the least benefit to members of the company is women. For the last one, the organizations themselves. The theory of justice can help to create the condition of place and environment where it can arise by applying the principle of equal opportunity, open to or under condition of equity, where some may need something that facilitates them more in achieving the goal, but this opportunity may be considered strictly in order to maintain equal need in the principle of equity by making it available for all. Under the, fair of, under the fair opportunity. For example, getting equal training for all to enable them to bring their talent and develop more. We live with the simple, easy to understand summary of law daily of justice. The first bit on the social contract idea and reputation against utilitarianism. Uh, John Law produced a theory of justice. And next one, Instead of adopting new territorial theories, Raw believed that fair distribution of resource should be the preferred condition of nature. And lastly, a theory of justice asserts uh, that every individual has an equal right to fundamental rights and that they should have an equal opportunity and chance as other people of comparable ability. Thank you. <laughs>